break. Bible study is from Matthew 24, verse 29 through 31. It says this, Immediately after the tribulation of those days, the sun will be darkened, and the moon will not give its light, and the stars will fall from heaven, and the powers of the heavens will be shaken. Then will appear in heaven the sign of the Son of Man, and then all the tribes of the earth will mourn, and they will see the Son of Man coming on the clouds of heaven with power and great glory. And he will send out his angels with a loud trumpet call, and they will gather his elect from the four winds, from one end of heaven to the other. After the seven-year tribulation, there will be believers. Zechariah 12 talks about how they will see the one who they have pierced, and they will mourn for him. When he comes, people are going to know who this is. But they're going to know it's the Jesus that you and I have been talking about for 2,000 plus years. And he's going to come in great power, great glory, and everybody's going to know it. And he's going to come and set up his reign on earth with us who believe in him for a thousand years. I'm excited to be with him either in death to meet him, in the rapture to meet him, or in the thousand year reign to meet him, to be with him. I look forward to that. Hopefully you do too. And hopefully all the effort you make to follow Christ, to obey him, to proclaim him, even if you are dealing with embarrassment or with frustration or broken relationships, I think one day it'll all make sense and it'll all be worth it. Have a great day.